All right, here we go. Hey guys, uh, we're filming this Thursday, January 7th. Uh, if you didn't know, we just got the news. All restrictions in BC have been extended to February 5th. So what does that mean? That means no adult group classes, no adult sports until February 5th. So that means we only got open gym. So please book your open gym sessions. And I, uh, uh, I'm sorry. That's all I can say. I'm sorry. So no, no, no classes, no group sports for adults until February 5th. Um, book your open gym though. Okay, here we go. I want to run a 45 to 50 minute workout. We're going to skip a little bit. So you do need a skipping rope. You do, you, you can use a medicine ball or you can modify the things we're doing uh, if you don't want to use a medicine ball. But I got made using a pretty light one. You don't need to grab a very heavy one. And remember, come, when you're coming into the gym, the med medicine balls are just over by the door, skipping ropes on the wall. Just grab one and have it at your station. Um, this is gonna be pretty fast paced, pretty simple. I don't wanna give you uh, complicated instruction. I don't wanna have to cover anything that, that um, um, you're not gonna be able to do. So everything in this session, you're gonna be able to do it. Have a good squat, have a good workout. And most of you are doing this in our open gym. So if you have any questions, just call me over, call me over and we'll help you out at a distance. Okay, if you're doing it at home or, or another gym, hit me up, DM me, DM me and ask, uh, email me and ask me the questions and, and I'll, I'll answer them for you. But if you are doing this during the open gym, just call us over and we'll help you out. Okay, here we go. Get that skipping rope, guys. Here we go. So May's going to do it all because I'm lazy. So she's going to work out with you. So if you need some inspiration, look down at your little screen and check out what May's doing. She's still going, so you know you can keep going. And I'm just going to bark orders. So every now and then, look down at the screen, but just keep your ears open and listen for the audio cues. We're going to skip for one minute. Here we go, and now. All right. Um, most of you guys are orthodox fighters with your left, left, uh, left leg forward. Keep the left leg forward for the entire workout. If you're going to do a second workout throughout the week or a third workout, why don't you do the next workout in a southpaw stance or your opposite stance? Give yourself a little bit of variety. Still got about 40 seconds to skip. I think it's a great way to do it, uh, a great way to get variety. So do an entire session in your in your uh, orthodox stance. Next time you come in, do an entire session in your southpaw stance. It's a great way to get some variation and uh, get some balance in all your muscles. Let's keep skipping for about 20 more seconds. If you're doing this during the open gym, stay in your box. Okay, you know I'm going to kick you back in your box if you're moving out of that box. Stay in that area. Everybody's got that three meters of separation. Keep skipping for 10 more seconds. Here we go. What am I doing now? Here we go. Five, four, three, two, one. Just put the rope down out of the way. And in your box, you got your two end lines. And if you watch what May's gonna do, she's just gonna shuffle from line to line. Sidestep to one line and touch, sidestep to the other line and touch. Just like that. I got you for 20 seconds, guys. Here we go. Make sure you bend your legs. Don't bend forward at the waist. Bend your legs down, touch the floor. Shuffle with agility. 10 seconds. You guys know that me and May have been in that same bubble since the start of this pandemic, so we don't mind getting this close to each other. Remember that, you guys should be masked up if you're getting this close to each other though. In three, two, and one. Set yourself up guys for some air squats. Just nice easy air squats. Go, 20 seconds. Weight on your heels. If you got a mirror around, look in the mirror and make sure your knees are not buckling in. Make sure your knees are not folding out. Keep your weight on your heels. Bum goes back. You got seven seconds of air squats guys. Yes, I'm reading off my notes. My memory is going. Come on, in two and one. I'll put you down for some push-ups. Round one of push-ups, guys. Hands wider than shoulders. 20 seconds of work. Ready, set, go. You want your abs tight. You want that lower back flat. You want to bring your chest down towards the floor. Give a breath out as you push up, push up. Come on, guys, 10 seconds. You see May down there doing it bent knee. We don't mind that at all. Bent knee, straight leg, same, same to me. Just make sure you're doing your push-ups. In three, in two, in one, good job. Come on up, let's grab that rope. Have that ball nearby, because the next set we're gonna use that ball, and if you don't wanna use the ball, just modify. One minute to skip, go! What else, what else? Yeah, open gym, book your open gym sessions, please. I think you're doing this during the open gym. 
And you guys, some of you guys who, who are maybe a little intimidated to come in and train self-directed, this video is for you. Put it on the ground, put on the earphones, put the earphones on and work out. Listen to my cues, watch what May's doing. This would be a good workout for some of you who aren't quite used to doing self-directed training. Exactly for you. And man, hopefully after February 5th, we can get back to regular adult group classes. You know, what can I say? There's not much more I can say. 15 seconds. Shout out to all our friends in Quebec who are undergoing an 8 p.m. curfew. I feel for you guys, 8 p.m. to 5 a.m. curfew. Shout out to all my friends in Montreal and Quebec. Three, two, one. Roll down, grab that med ball. And again, it doesn't have to be too heavy. And just a reminder, the black rubber ones, you can slam into the ground. The colored ones will bounce back up in your face. So please don't slam the colored ones. Only slam those black ones, okay? But we're not slamming right now. She's gonna pick it up with two hands. She's gonna go back to her side to side drill and she's just gonna touch the ball to the mat every time she comes to an end line. Ready, set, go, 20 seconds. Touch the ball to the floor. And even there, bend the legs. Don't bend forward at the waist. Bend down the legs. Touch the ball to the mat on each end line. 10 more seconds. Oh, guys, working hard, working hard. May's working hard, you're working hard. I'm not working hard. And one, keep the ball, guys, legs wide. You're just gonna squat down and give me a push press over your head. Squat, push press, go. 20 seconds, squat, push press. Breathe out as you push the ball up into the air. And same idea with the squats. Bum back, weight on your heels. Don't let the knees flex in or out. Eight seconds, guys. Good job. Breathe out on the way up. In three, in two, and one. We don't need the ball, so you just put it right down, out of the way though. Give me a second set of push-ups, and this time, hands narrower than shoulders. Have the thumbs touching and uh, pointing fingers touching if you can. And go, narrow push-ups. 20 seconds. A little bit extra tricep work when you're doing narrow push-ups. 15 seconds. That's it. Good job, guys. Good job. 10 seconds, all the way down and up. It's not about qual quantity of reps, guys. Give me quality reps. In three, two, one, time. Come on up. Give me one more one minute round on your skipping rope. You check out the rope that May's using. That's that thick, heavy blue one. And I think we got red and green ones as well. I love the heavy skipping ropes. I know some of you guys are a little scared of them, but man, you get used to it. So go ahead and pick up the heavy skipping rope. We got the light ones too. Light one's fine, but every now and then pick up the heavy one and use that heavy skipping rope. 30, uh, one minute. Ready, set, go. Extra conditioning for the forearms. You feel it in the shoulders. You feel it in the wrists. Also, you feel it in the lungs. It's a little bit of extra work to get that heavy rope around. So you get your lungs really burning up. I love the heavy rope. Unless it hits my toes, <laughs> then I don't like the heavy rope. Yeah. But the better you get at it, the less it will hit your toes. Okay? Come on, here we go. You got last 30 seconds of skip. So if you have a little bit more speed in you, you're gonna go down. Let's go a little quicker on the rope. Keep it up, guys. 20 more seconds. You got it. 15 seconds. Give me 100% speed. Let's go, let's go. Come on. Last skipping in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, time. Good job. Just a rope down. We, we will use that rope a little bit later. And grab your ball. Okay, here we go. Legs wide, oh sorry, legs narrow. Hands up with the ball in front of your face. And if you can just uh, see what I'm doing here, I'm gonna spread my legs out wide, squat to the ground, touch the ball to the ground, I mean, and then come back up and bring the hot hands up to my face. Drop squats using the med ball. Let, and go, 20 seconds. Good. Hands in front of your face with the feet narrow, hands on the ground with your dropping for that squat. Come on. 15 seconds, yeah, good job guys. Give me 10 seconds, 
Nice work, nice work. Try to keep a nice straight spine, huh? Don't bend over that upper back. Come on. Seven. Come on, six. Five. You guys doing great. Come on, four. Three. Two. And one. Hold that squat. Ball is about shoulder, uh, chest high. We're going to squat down, and rather than just push press, we're going to toss and catch. Squat, toss and catch. Make sure you watch out for the ceiling. Don't you throw it, don't throw that ball too high. Ready, set, squat and toss, go. Just like May's doing there, if you don't know what I mean, take a look at your screen. She's squatting, she tosses the ball in the air, catches it, and squats back down with it. Squat and toss, 10 seconds left, guys, let's go. Five seconds, keep it up, keep it up. Breathe out on the way up now. Two and one. Put the ball out of the way for now. One more push-up set. Your hands will start wide. You do a push-up. Bring your hands narrow and do a push-up. Wide push-up, narrow push-up, wide push-up, narrow. Go! 20 seconds. Yeah. You can do just like me there where she's throwing her hands out wide together, throwing them together narrow, just throwing them out at the same time. Or you can just walk them one hand in at a time. Walk them out one hand at a time. Seven, six, five, four, three. Two, one, relax. Take a little water if you need, guys. You're gonna grab your skipping rope, lay it down on the ground and give me a nice straight line, just as a guideline, because we're gonna hop side to side over your rope, but not directly in front of your bag, because we're actually gonna go to the bag and do some kicks as well. Further. Yeah, because you're gonna hit the bag. So you don't wanna, you don't wanna put it right directly in front of the heavy bag. Good job. You guys back? You got your rope down, just like me. You're just using that rope as a little guideline. Feet together, knees together, facing your bag, uh, May's facing her bag, jump side to side to side to side. Ready, set, go! Hop, 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 just like that. Nice little bit of agility, little bit good, good use of the calves, good use of the lungs, lungs starting to go. Come on, side, 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 side. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, Four, three, two, one. Get in front of your bag, guys. You square stance. Hands up. So don't make a fighting stance yet. Left push, right push, alternate. 30 seconds. Go. Push, push. Good. And then just like me, you don't have to blast the bag right now. You're still loosening up, warming up. That bag shouldn't be swinging too far away from your push kick. And look at that steady pace. Left, right, left, right. Make sure it's the ball of the foot. Get that knee up before you extend that push kick out. 10 more seconds, guys. Good work. You can swing the kicking arm to the ground. You can swing the kicking arm down as long as the other arm stays up. Three, two, one. Go back to your rope and face it. Hop forward, backward, forward, backward, and go. Just like that. And you don't know what I'm talking about. Take a look at your phone to see what May's doing. Hopping forward, back, forward, back. Good job for 10. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, pause everybody. You got 10 second break. Breathe. Woo. I'm gonna bring you back at the side to side hop. Ready, in five, in four, you're gonna hop side to side, ready, and now go, quick. You want your feet together, you want your knees together. You don't wanna spend too much time on one side. You're just quickly hop, 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 come on. Come on, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Get back in front of the bag. You're gonna hold your left knee up, hands up, and all you're gonna do is give me some balance, push kicks, push kicks, without putting that left foot down to the ground. Knee up about waist high, and work, go. You're playing catch with the bag. Push the bag and catch it. Push the bag and catch it with the same foot without putting that foot down. Balance, balance, balance. And if you're using your left leg, yes, you can drop your left arm as long as your right hand stays up. That left arm is a nice tool for counterbalance as you're using a left push kick. Seven, come on now. Three seconds. And get back to your rope. Let's jump forward, backward, set, two, forward, backward, ready, set, go. In, out, in, out. Agile, guys. Mobile. Hostile? 
Are you hostile? Nah. Agile, mobile, and hostile. That's May. She's hostile. And so you go to Terra Breads and ask her for coffee. She's gonna be hostile towards you. Come on. Two, one. Get back to. Oh, wait, pause. Breathe. Take 10, 9, 8. We're going back to side to side in 7, 6, 5, 4. Get ready, guys. Hop sideways. Go! Last one, quickest one. Come on. Yeah, look at that, look at that. Don't spend too much time on one side. Quick, hop, 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 hop. Breathe, gotta breathe. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Get back in front of the bag. We did our left leg earlier. Let's do our right leg this time. So the knee about waist high and then balance those push kicks. Go! And this time you can drop your right arm with each kick. Drop your right arm with each kick. Keep the left arm up. That right arm counterbalances the, the right leg as you kick. 10 seconds, guys. Oh, sorry, 15 seconds, guys. Unedited video. You get all the mistakes. Every mistake. I'm not editing anything out. Look, I'm reading off my notes. I'm not even editing that out. Come on, in three, two, one. Last hops over and back, forward and back on your rope. 20 seconds, go. You got it. You're looking for speed. You're looking for quickness. You want to be light on your balls and your feet. Don't want to spend too much time in the air or on the ground. Just quick, 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 quick. Come on. Eight, seven, six, in five. You put your gloves on in four. Put your gloves on in three, two, time. Can you take your rope? And if you work in the open gym, go ahead and throw it on the tarp. And then you know what happens. I'll disinfect those ropes. Go ahead and put your gloves on. Take a little water if you need. Okay, now we really get to work. <laughs> Keep that med ball around though. Don't put that med ball away. You guys doing all right? If you're doing all right and you're working this during the open gym, turn and face me and say, hey Ray, I'm doing all right. <laughs> <laughs> and then I'll look at you and say, yes, you're doing, you're doing very well. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> okay, here we go. We're warming up uh, on the bag right now. We're getting some hitting. Left side strikes only, so you can jab, you can hook, you can uppercut, you can left knee, any elbow, you can left push, left round. One minute, only working your left side, and go. Ah, look at that, going low, going high, go with the body. Combine strikes, jab, teeth, jab, roundhouse kick, elbows, knees. Only the left side. Remember guys, maintain your stance. If you're fighting orthodox right now, keep your orthodox stance the whole round. If you're a southpaw, keep it southpaw the whole, the entire session. Good job, left side still. 30 more seconds on the left side. Get those roundhouse kicks. You don't have to kick too high if you're still loosening up. You don't have to kick too hard. Get those push kicks. Some of you guys got your side kicks and your spin kicks, tornado kicks. Just loosening up everything on the left side of your body. Elbows, don't forget those elbows. Go to the body, changing levels, go to the body. 10 more seconds on the left side, everybody. In four, three, two, everybody go to the right side, let's go. Don't switch stance though, keep your regular stance. Go to your right arm, right leg, right knee, right elbow. Yeah, get in tight and throw those elbows. Get in tight and throw those knees. Back up a little bit and throw those long punches. Push kicks and round kicks. Cut kicks. Kick low, kick high. 40 seconds, everybody. Nice. Combine some speed. Pop, pop. Have some power. Single shots for power. Double a double roundhouse for speed. Triple roundhouse for speed. Changing levels on those roundhouse. Can you spin and use your right leg? Then spin, go ahead. 20 seconds. Good work, guys. Heart rate up. May's already sweating. Look at that. May's, all, May's always sweating. She sweats when she walks. So Come on. Eight seconds. Here we go. Here we go. In five. We're going to do a punching burnout, guys. In three, two, one, two, one, two. Non stop. 30 seconds. Go. Nice. You want to have 100% speed, about 50% power. Come on. Go, 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 go. All out speed. Got to breathe. You gotta breathe. 15 seconds, I'll give you a break. 
Come on, come on. 10 seconds. Come on, come on. Eight, seven, six. Let's go, guys. In five, I'll give you a break. In four, three, two, rest, everybody. Don't go too far. Breathe. Don't go too far. Take about 30. Woo. I gave a shout out to my friends in Quebec. Yes. I did. Hey, shout out to my friends in California. The Boxing Club, San Diego. Shout out to you guys in, in California. I know you're having a tough time as well. I know you're having issues with your governor. And oh, yeah. and you're going through all sorts of lockdowns and restrictions. So shout out to all my friends down in San Diego. You guys, if you guys see this, the Boxing Club. What a great gym in San Diego. You guys ready? Woo! Here we go. One minute. All you're going to work is your hands. Boxing only. You can use both hands, go to the body, go to the head, change levels, speed combos, power combos. One minute. Boxing only. Ready, set, go. Change levels, guys. Don't just head hunt. Change levels. Go to the body. Give me some angles. Side steps, which we're going to work later on. Work in those angles. Work those shifts. And again, let me repeat. You got to go to the body. Don't just head hunt. Go to the body, go to the head with your boxing. Keep it up, keep it up. Got about 35 seconds. Hands only, 35 seconds. Changing, uh, changing distances as well. Get right in there and throw those short shots. Hooks to the body, uppercuts to the body. Get out long, throw those long ones and twos. 15 seconds, a little bit of in and out play. If you saw that with me, she goes in and out with that jab. I like that, 10 seconds. Keep those hands up, keep those hands up. Let's do that breathing, I hope you're breathing. In three, two, get right up on the bag. You're going with knees and elbows only. One minute of knees and elbows, go. You can clinch the bag and grab it. You can do knees without grabbing. You can use all your elbows. Up elbow, down elbow, horizontal elbow. Spike at it. Boom with the back elbow. Throw those knees with the clinch, without the clinch. Side knees, round knees, straight knee. That little corkscrew that I showed you guys. 30 seconds. Keep up, keep up. Boy, keep breathing, keep breathing, keep breathing. You're working hard, but keep going. I know you're working hard. Come on, guys. 15 seconds. Then we're gonna do another burnout. Breathe, breathe. Knees and elbows, guys. Knees and elbows. Crush, crush. Five seconds. We're gonna do a burnout again. We're gonna do three, four, three, four, and three, two, one. Ready, set, go. Three, four, three, four. Go, go, go. Speed. One hand's at the bag, the other hand at the face. You gotta make sure one hand always transfers back to the face. 20 seconds. Come on, guys. I'll give you a break in 15. Let's go, let's go. Give me 10 seconds. Three, four, three, four. Come on, come on, come on. Here we go, five seconds. Time, break. Don't go too far. Breathe, breathe. Gotta take a little water if you need. And remember guys, I'm setting a pretty pretty uh, uh, fast pace. Feel free to go your own pace. You wanna slow down. I'm doing like one minute round. I'm doing a 30 second burnout, doing a 20 second amount of pushups. Hey man, you wanna do one, skip one. Hey, you wanna you, you want you wanna do pause and then come back into it? Hit the hit the pause on the on the video. Go ahead. Uh, hit the pause, you come over and say hi to me. Whatever, you know? Do whatever whatever you can. And as long as you get a good workout and a good sweat, I'll be happy. Okay, and it's really all about my happiness, right? <laughs> That's all it is. That's all that matters. <laughs> Ready, one minute, just kicks. Throw your teeps, your push kicks, throw your roundhouse kicks. Some of you guys can side kick and spin kick. One minute, let me get the legs rocking. And go! Legs only, kicks only, I mean, kicks only. Double it up, triple it up. Kick low, kick high, kick to the body. Come on, here we go, here we go. 45 seconds. If you're getting tired and you're getting winded, just slow down your activity. You don't have to throw 100 kicks a minute. Hey man, you're getting a little tired, slow yourself down. Throw 50 kicks a minute. Next time, we'll throw 60. It's all about progression, okay? Nobody's perfect right away. May, who's perfect right away? 
Nobody. Nobody. Ah, I, I, I thought she was going to say me. <laughs> come on, come on. 15 seconds. Let's go. Kicks only. Come on, come on. Oh, there. Playing around with range. A little bit of defense there. Good job. Kicks only. Seven seconds. Turn up the pace a little. And get right up on the bag. This time, instead of knees and elbows, I want you to go to the body with your boxing. Hooks, uppercuts, maybe step back and throw a one or two. Body shots only. Go! One minute. And because we're ripping those body shots, guys, give me some power. Give me some power. Come on, guys. Come on, guys. Ooh, yeah. Give me power on that. Oh, boom. Oh. Hook, uppercut. Step back and throw a power shot, two to the body. Hands only to the body. Come on, 40 seconds. Should be ripping for power now. Look at that, look at that. Rip to the body, come on. Liver shot, kidney shot. Crush the ribs. 30 seconds. Nice, nice. 20 seconds. Breathing, breathing. Check your footwork and balance. You don't want to be off balance with your footwork. 15 seconds. You guys got agility. I know you're agile. Come on, 10 seconds. A little bit of angle play, a little bit of angle play. Come on, five seconds. We got another burnout. We're gonna go uppercuts on this burnout. Two, get right up on there. Let's go. Five, six, five, six, five, six, go. Burn up, burn up, burn up. Come on, go, 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 go. Double, triple your speed. 10 down, 20 to go. Come on now, come on now. Turn it on. Turn it on, 15 to go. All your speed. I'll give you a longer break at the end of this one. Come on, 10 seconds. That's it. Eight, seven, six, let's go, let's go. Four, three, two, time. Take a minute, you can gloves off if you want. Take some water, w wave at me. Goes, hey Ray, that was a very hard warm up. Can you not make it so hard next time? Can you, you can say that to me if you want, I'll ignore you, but. You can try. Woo, good job, guys. Woo. See what May's doing? She got sweat all over the ground. Good job. So sweaty. Woo. Nice work. Take water, take some towel. When you're ready, guys, throw your gloves back on. If you're not quite ready yet to get started, just hit pause, because I'm going to start in a couple seconds. And there's nothing wrong with hitting pause on, on the video, guys, if you want to take a break. Like I said, go your own pace. Uh, uh, you want to push yourself. You want to take it to that next level. But it's also all about progression. So if you're going 100 today, or sorry, if you're going 90 today, you can go 100 next time. If you're going 50 today, go 60 next time. You can go 70 the next time. It's all about the journey, okay? You don't have to try to go all out at the expense of your health as well. You're trying to get in shape, trying to get fit. You're not trying to injure yourself. Come on, here we go. Lesson number one. We talked about this a little bit during this week on my suggested workout. I want you guys to do a sidestep three on the heavy bag. And it's a really quick lesson because I'll face the, the camera. You do want to jump both feet laterally. And as you jump laterally, and don't jump too high, you're basically hovering over the mat. You're gonna hover over the mat, jump sideways, and throw that number three, that left hook at the same time. If there's a heavy bag right here, my fist lands on that heavy bag. At the same time, both feet move over on the, and hit the ground. Bang! So the feet and the glove hit the heavy bag, my feet hit the floor at the same time. I would like you to try to do this though, because it's okay to just throw the three and jump sideways. I'd like you to try to pull your right hip and your right shoulder backwards as you jump to the side. Boom! So do you see what I've done? I've created an angle with my body and it gives you a better action on your right roundhouse kick. Left if you're a southpaw. Okay, I'm jumping left on a side step three. I pull my right shoulder and my right hip back, and that gives me a shot at the bag. And if you watch what May's gonna do on the bag, she's gonna side step three. If she pulled her shoulder and her hip back, which you may not see in the video, she got a good shot at the roundhouse kick. Okay, you get to adjust how far you jump, how far away you are at the beginning. 
because you are going to kick after you. So you're transitioning from punching distance to kicking range. So you have to decide how far to jump and how far to start away from the bag. So I'm going to give you about 45 seconds to just practice your side step three. And if you have any questions and if you're here for open gym, just call me over. Side step three, right kick. Practice. Good, you guys, just keep practicing that. Change the levels of your kick. Sometimes you're kicking low, sometimes with the body, sometimes with the head, and just keep working that side step three. Remember, it's okay to just laterally jump to the left, but I'd like you to try to pull your right shoulder and right hip back so you got a shot at that right roundhouse kick. Left if you're a southpaw, okay? You're kicking the left leg if you're a southpaw, and you're throwing a right hook if you're a southpaw. 15 more seconds on this rep, guys, on this set. Nice, nice. Call me over if you're having difficulty and I'll help you out. Hit pause and practice whatever. And instead of a side step three, right kick, a roundhouse kick, I'd like you to do a one, two, side step three and kick. And that kick, let's go over the leg. So your combo is one, two, side step three, and then cut down on the thigh. Practice, go. Yeah, one, two, side step three, kick. Yeah, what's the power distribution? The power's in the kick, guys. The one, two is a quick setup. Good flash three, and then boom, give me power on that kick. The one, two, three should not be that powerful. It really is a setup just for that power kick. One, two, side step, three, kick. Nice, get that shin on that bag. Turn that front of the shin down over on that bag. And pause, take a breather. That's the side step three with a kick. We also wanna work a side step two. And on a side step two, my right leg, cause I'm an orthodox fighter, shoots horizontally to the right, my left foot, drags in behind. So I don't wanna just shoot my right foot out and turn. I'm shooting my right foot horizontally. And my left foot slides in behind. There's the weight on the right. I gotta shift weight onto the left by throwing a number two. Side step two, throw the right foot out, drag the left in behind, shift the weight from the back foot to the front foot as you throw that number two. Side step two, I'm gonna give you 45 seconds to practice on the back. Go. Yeah, keep doing that. Side step two, that weight shift is what's gonna give you the power in the punch, guys. If you don't shift that weight, then you're just using an arm punch. I want you to add a switch kick. Side step two, switch kick. Nice, and in May's, May's uh, uh, stance, she's gonna go left switch kick. Some of you guys are gonna go right switch kick and just southpaw. Side step two, switch kick. Gotta have distance management, so make sure you're managing the distance from the punching range to the kicking range. If it feels too close or too far, hit pause, call me over, and I'll help you out with your distance management. Good job, guys. Side step two, kick. Let's extend the combo, guys. You're gonna shoot a one, two, side step two, three, two, and then that switch kick, okay? One, two, side step, two, three, two, switch kick. Let's work on that for a little bit. And go, one, two, side step two, three, two, switch kick. One, two, side step, two, three, two, switch kick. Practice. Good job, guys, good breathing. And again, managing your distance. You don't want to be too close for that switch kick, but you don't want to be too far away so you can't hit that punch. Nice work, nice work. One more practice here. Nice job. Everybody on the bag, I'm gonna pyramid speed kick you. You're gonna go five fast kicks per leg, Four speed kicks each leg. Three, three, two, two, one, one. Ready, set, now. Five and five. And when you're done five and five, give me four and four. 
and then three each leg, and then two each leg, then one each leg, then you can take a pause. Good job. Breathe. Did you beat me? I hope so. <laughs> Breathe. Breathe. Take some water if you want. Good job, guys. <laughs> I didn't know she was finished. I told you, unedited, unfiltered. We didn't even <laughs> rehearse this. I don't even know what's going on. I just have my notes. Yeah, I, notes. I don't know what's going on. I do know that we're not allowed to do group class till February 5th, though. Um. <laughs> I'm not dwelling on it, though, May. I'm not dwelling on it. I let it go. I did not. I can't let it go. Who else? Shout out to my friends in Quebec. Shout out to my friends in California. Who else? Oh. Anybody? <laughs> Shout out to people who are in our position who can't reopen. Shout out to all our colleagues who yeah. are... Yeah. Anyway, <laughs> so we're now we're going to do a self-directed round. I'm going to set two-minute rounds. You have um, every right to do three minutes, four minutes, five minutes, whatever. But I'm doing two-minute rounds for this one. Maybe for the next workout, I'll do two-minute rounds again. Then I'll move it up to three-minute rounds. I'm just playing around with the timing and all that. And all that. So we're doing two-minute rounds today. Round one, this is where you're going to do a little bit of self-direction. You're working your heavy bag on your own. Punches, kicks, knees, elbows. Do your Muay Thai strikes. I'd like you to do your one, two, sidestep three, low kick as your point of focus. So I'd say in a two minute round, one, two, sidestep three, low kick, perform it eight or nine times in a two minute round. And then uh, uh, the next round, we'll focus on the one, two, sidestep two, okay? So in this round, freestyle Thai boxing work with a one, two, sidestep three, low kick focus. I'm gonna yell out every now and then, five and five. And that means you stop what you're doing, give me five speed kicks each leg, and then go back to what you were doing. Here we go, round one, freestyle with a focus on one, two, side step, three kick. Go! Two minutes, guys. Work your hands, work your knees, work your elbows. Give me some speed combinations, give me some power shots. And remember, one, two, side step, three, low kick is your focus combination for this round. Get those hands up. Five and five, go! Get back to work as soon as you've done five each leg. Good job. Breathe, guys. Breathe. Good idea to dig to the body. You go to the body and that opens up the head. I hate it when people just head hunt. You gotta go to the body. You gotta kick low. Five and five, go. Head back to work. Good job. Make sure you breathe, make sure you breathe. Nice work. Round one, still got 50 seconds to go. Five zero, five zero. Come on, guys. It's the most important punch in boxing. Jab, use it. What's the most important kick in Thai boxing? Push kicks, use them both, use them both. Push kick, deep all. Jabbing is your most important punch. 30 more seconds, guys. Five and five, go. You got it now. Come on, come on. We got about 20 seconds left. Come on, come on, come on. 15 more seconds. Remember your focus combination. One, two, side step, three, kick. 10 more seconds now. I'm going to do a burnout. You know we're going to do a burnout. We can't end around with a burnout. Come on. Keep going. Keep going. Two. You're going to give me alternate roundhouse. Left, right, left, right. Go. 20 seconds. Got it. 15. Burn out, burn out, burn out. Gotta breathe. Swing those arms as you kick. 10 seconds, everybody. Here we go. That's it. Six. And rest, everybody. Woo! Woo. Good job. Take a rest. We're already at the four, almost the 40 minute mark. So I guess my timing is a little off. Don't worry about it. Uh, we'll just play with it. Don't worry. My timing's off. Breathe. Take some water, guys. Good job. Good job. 
Breathe. Remember, the focus combination for round two is your one, two, side step, two, three, two, and switch kick. That's what you were working on earlier. Put away the one, two, side step, three kick for now, and put the one, two, side step, two, three, two kick into your toolbox. Keep working, self-directed round, punch, kick, knees, elbows, and you gotta do one, two, side step, two, three, two kick, nine or 10 times in two minutes. Ready, round two, fight, go! Keep a listen for a five and five. Okay, I'm still gonna yell out those five and fives. Nice work, get those hands up. Yeah, look at what me is doing. You gotta play with your distances, distances too. Sometimes you're in tight, working those knees and elbows. You're in that medium range, working your boxing, going on the body. You're working in for your long range, going for your kicks. And always, always your focus combination. One, two, side step, two, three, two, switch kick. Always working that. Self-directed. You want to work all the levels of the bag. Head kick or head shots, body shots, leg kicks. Some of you guys are great at your spinning techniques. Don't forget your spinning techniques from distance, like your tornado kick or your spinning back kick. Some of you guys got a really great spinning elbow from close range. Use it. 55 seconds to go. Five and five, go! You almost made me forget. I almost forgot the five and five. Get back to it. Unedited, unrehearsed. I'm just flying by the seat of my pants here. 35 guys, 35. Five, hit it! Woo. You got about 20 seconds left this round. Of course, we're gonna do a burnout at the end. Ten more seconds, guys. Here we go. Four, three. What's our burnout gonna be? Everybody, grab the bag. Both hands about ear high. You're right up to the bag. Give me knees, 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 go. Left, right, left, right, left, right, go. Right up on that bag, everybody, right up on that bag. Your hands are about ear high. Knee, knee. Give me a little bit of a pulling action on the bag. Pull, pull, pull. Kick that leg back before you knee forward. Seven, six, you got this. Five, four, here we go. Three, two, time. Take a break. Breathe. Take some water. Good job, everybody. Oh, wow, I'm, I'm taking this one so overtime. I've got a lot of overtime. Who else? Who else should I? Oh, you know, shout out to our friends in Ontario who are also experiencing pretty bad COVID numbers and a pretty strict lockdown. Shout out to all our friends in Ontario. Shout out to our friends in Quebec with that darn 8 p.m. curfew. Shout out to my friends in California, the boxing club. Very, very strict rules in California as well. Tough, tough time for all. All right, round three. I want you to do a freestyle round, self-directed. Now I want you to integrate both of our focus combinations. One, two, side step, three, kick, or one, two, side step, two, three, two, switch kick. So you have both combinations to focus on and you have a self-directed freestyle round. Ready, round three, go, two minutes. I won't forget the five and fives this time. Five and five, go! Good job, you guys are working hard, man. I love it, I love it. Me, me is working hard. I'm the only one here not working hard, but I don't mind. Come on. Boy, yeah, look at this. Changing levels of the kicks. You guys are super warm now. So you gotta be able to get those kicks up high now. Get in there with the knees and elbows, just like May's doing right there. Stay out long and throw your long techniques. Five and five, go. Get back to it once you're done. 
How many times have I said it? I'm gonna keep saying it. Oh, the body, everybody. You gotta go with the body. A lot of times it's those body shots that free up the head for the knockout. A lot of times you'll get a knockout just punching in the head. But you know what? You get that head shot better if you go with the body first. Five and five, go! Get back to it. You remember the focus if you don't know what to do. Throw a one, two, sidestep, three kick. Or throw a one, two, sidestep, two, three, two kick. Focus on those two combos. If you don't know what to do, just keep doing our two focus combinations. Otherwise, self-direct yourself, working your Thai boxing strikes. This finish, this burnout's gonna be a little different because I'm gonna go right from round three, right into round four without a break. We're gonna hit one more five and five. Now, five and five. I'm gonna go right into round four. Okay, we're on round four. Get right up on that bag. I'm gonna go left hook to the body, left hook to the head. Body, head, body, head, go. Power, power. Body, head, left hook, left hook. Three, three, body, head, body, head. Come on, guys. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. In five seconds. Four seconds, you can go four of the body, four of the head, right hook, right hook, two, one, now! Hook, hook, body, head, body, head. Let's use our legs, let's use our hips, let's rotate our upper body so we're not just arm punching, guys. 10 seconds, burn it up, burn it up, come on, guys. Five, uh, five four, three, two, one. We're all back to the number three side. Body, head, head, head on the orthodox fighters. Left hook, left hook, right hook, left hook. Body, body, head, body, head, head, head. Ready, set, go. Three, three, four, three. Three, three, four, three. Three, three, four, three. Come on now. Three, three, four, three. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five. Four, three, two, immediately, other side. Four, four, three, four, go. Body, head, head, head. Body, head, head, head. Four, four, three, four. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, we're not done yet. In your fighting stance, give me a little bit of distance between you and the bag. Power, right, roundhouse. Ready, set, go! Single shots. Get all you can in each kick, all you can. That's right, you can stop the bag from swinging. This is not a, something you wanna do. I'm not asking you to do 100 kicks in 20 seconds. I'm, giving, I'm asking you to throw single power shots, quality and power, each rep. Hands up, swing that on. You should be pivoting that bottom foot. You should be up on the ball of your foot. Don't ever try to pivot flat-footed. In three, two, one. Power switch kick, go. Power switch kick. Come on, guys, power shot. Don't, don't try to kick too, too many too fast. I just want one quality power switch kick. Stop the bag from swinging and then do it again. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, Five, four, three, two, clinch the bag. Five seconds of speed, knees, go. Five, four, three, you're gonna shoot any elbow. Elbow, clinch it in me again. Five, four, three, you're gonna shoot any elbow. Elbow, two more. Five, four, you can shoot any arm, any type of elbow you want. Elbow, last one, five, four, Three, two, elbow! Time. Gloves off, take some water, catch your breath. Woo! Good job. 
I've been running this one a little bit longer than I thought I would. My timing was a little bit off, so I didn't get to do some medicine ball work in between rounds. I had some lunging and some, and some slams in mind, but our, our timing was off, so I'll know a little bit, bit better for, for next time we do this, so I'll be able to set my timing a little bit better. So I will not use the, the medicine ball for this one, but uh, next time for sure, I'm gonna make you do some med ball work in between every round, because hey, that's what we do here. On the back, huh, I want one more push-up set though. So I'll, I'll down on the ground your push-up set. I just want this finish down at the bottom. You're gonna give me that bottom range uh, uh, from the bottom to the halfway, bottom to half. Really quick half range of motion push-ups. Ready, set, go. Yeah, look at what May's doing guys. Just the, the bottom range from the bottom to the half, bottom to the half, bottom to the half. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, Three, two, pause for a sec. Now we're gonna do from the top half to the bottom half. Top half to the bottom half. You gotta do these quick. Ready, set, go. Top to half, top to the half, top to the half. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Last set, full range of motion. Ready, set, go. Push up, push up, push up. 10, nine, eight, seven, Six, five, four, three, two, one. Flip over onto your back, guys. And cross the foot onto a knee. Give me elbow to knee on one side. I give you about 10 seconds. Go. I'm gonna go grab a water. Come on. Five seconds, four, three, two, one. Other side, elbow to knee. Good job, guys. Five, four, three, two. Uncross your feet. Give me a, a, a butterfly sit-ups. Feet together, knees apart, and sit up through the butterfly. Give me 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, hands under your hips, guys. Drop your legs, raise your legs, go. Nice work. Keep booking your open gym. I will add more open gym availabilities the more people that book. Um, all the procedures and poli uh, uh, politics, all the procedures still, protocols still in place for COVID and you know how strict we are with that. You know, we're doing what we can and uh, all we can do right now is open gym for, for now. Come on, shoot your legs forward along the ground and up. Forward and up. 10, nine, eight, seven, six. Anytime you have any questions, if you are doing this video during open gym, just call me over, call me over and I'll help you out, okay? So don't be afraid to hit pause and then ask me for some, uh, some help and I'll help you out. Keep the feet up in the air, hands on your ears. You're gonna give me a quick crunch, 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 crunch. Here we go, here we go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, time. You can definitely do more abs if you want. You can definitely do more push-ups you want. All up to you. Thank you for joining us for our first heavy bag workout. This really is for everyone who's a little bit unsure of how to come in and do self-directed work on it, uh, uh, during our open gym. So if you are feeling a little bit antsy about that, here you go. Put the headphones on, put the phone on the ground, follow along with us, and we're gonna produce one of these every week. Uh, I'll try to produce one every week, a different one every week. And like I said, next time do this video in your opposite stance. That'll give you some variety and a little bit different use of your muscles. Thank you very much, I hope you had a good time. Uh, if you did this video, look over at me and May and give us a wave if you finished it, and we'll give you a thumbs up. Thank you everybody, be safe, be healthy. Oh, did I just do a Dr. Bonnie? What is it? Be kind, be safe, be kind. Be kind, be calm, be safe. <laughs> Just be safe. Ah. Thank you guys. We'll see you in class, or, or for open gym, no class.